If you love edible plants, it's about now that you're probably getting worried, and for a very good reason. A small fly that originated from the Mediterranean region and came here in a fresh food shipment is about to wreak havoc in WA. The Mediterranean fruit fly is active right now, flying from fruit to fruit, stinging the skin, laying eggs and leaving fruit maggot ridden and useless fruit on trees. Now, what can you do to beat it? Well, a friend of mine, Isabel Aravello Vigner, is a researcher working on a solution with communities across WA. Now, Isabel, I love my fruit and I want to get most of it. I do have to share some of it with the birds, but I hate sharing it with fruit fly. Now, fruit fly wasn't really a problem for a lot of people when we had the fruit fly spray, but that's gone now, isn't it? Yes, I think that for, for fruit growers, it still has some one more year. Yeah. But uh, in the last two or three years, there's no uses for home gardeners. Yeah. So that doesn't mean that people can do use other alternatives and homemade stuff can work as well. OK, will you show me some? Yes, please. Come okay. on. Well, here we come. Oh, there's it. Yeah, apricots are a, a really early sort of fruit and of course they get fruit fly really bad. So uh, I take it traps or something you're going to recommend? Well, this is something that you can find uh, in a commercial shop and you can set up a straight one and a half metres. That's perfect for okay. this kind of tree. So if I was to hang this from about this point here, now, one of the reasons um, the fruit fly come is because of that colour, isn't it? Well, yes, they have an attraction for these yellow, oranges, yeah. reddish hue. So that's why all the traps are this kind of uh, colour. Color. And then there's the holes where they enter on the inside. So we know that this is going to control fruit fly and the colour is one. Do you have to buy them? Is it? Can you make your own? Well, if some people are comfortable buying things. Yeah. But if for those that are crafty, you can come with things like that. Okay. That's simple. You can have this in your kitchen. That's part of a coat hanger. Yeah. Just Could be the ve Vegemite jar, the yellow top to the Vegemite the jar, plastic, plastic bottle. Peanut butter jars. And just hang them from the tree. Yeah, perfect. All right, that's a great way to do it. The problem begins with tiny eggs on fruit, which turn into maggots, eventually turning into mature fruit flies and continuing the breeding cycle. Now, the traps attractant uses a pre-mix liquid solution, which is added to bottles which make up the trap. The flies are attracted to the yellow colour and a pheromone, and they're overwhelmed and drown in the liquid solution. Isabel, obviously there's traps, there's baits, and they're really effective. What else can people do? Well, the most important thing is that people have a good hygiene in their backyard. Right. We've only just covered off some of the things. There's a lot of things people can do now to control fruit fly. How do people get in contact with you? How can they get more information? Well, I have set up a small website, yep. medflychallenge.com. OK. Uh, I would like to hear from people on some information they have, some ideas or what they require, so we can start tweaking out the information so they can understand or learn about things, and we can learn about their successes. Sensational.